Greetings. Greetings this morning in the name of the Lord. He is risen today. Amen. Yes, he is. Amen. That's why we're here. Amen. That's why we're here today. He's risen. We say welcome to everybody this morning. We look at crowd. Turn to your neighbor and tell them they're looking good today. Good to see everybody here this morning and uh, see a lot of visitors this morning and uh, say welcome to you. It's, this is the first time anybody's been in the church, this church this morning. Anybody for the very first time? Okay, yeah, there's a brave guy there. He raised his hand. Say welcome to you. We say welcome to you. If you're just visiting here this morning, we're glad that you made it. If you have a church of your own that you usually go to, we, we say that. Welcome to you. Glad that you took time to come here today. But if you don't have a church of your own, uh, come on back and be part of ours, all right? We love people here, and we're just glad that you made it today. Praise God. We had an Easter sunrise service this morning about uh, 6.30 at Battle Park. Uh, it was cold. It was cold out there this morning. But you know, uh, even in the park at uh, 6 o'clock in the morning, uh, the sun started to come up. Birds were singing like crazy. I never see so many birds in one place. They were just singing. It was like they were happy because they know today that, that today was Easter. You know, they were just rejoicing, it seemed like. And, but we could feel the presence of the Lord there in the park this morning. How many were in the park? I'm just about everybody up here, I know. Uh, great service. Sister Lori did the, the praise and worship. The band was here. They were there. Our pastor spoke this morning. did a great job. You know, it's, it's an awesome thing to stand with other people from other churches. Uh, there's no barrier there between us this morning. We're all one, one mind, one accord. Amen. And we worship the Lord. We, we, I didn't feel awkward or anything like that. We're just, we're just there just to worship the Lord. And it was an awesome feeling this morning just to, to be there. But, uh, you know, I'm excited about today because this is the day that, uh, that makes the difference in our lives. As the pastor spoke this morning, two days ago, uh, what happened at that time, two days ago, we had no hope. We had no hope. But because three days later, he's risen, we have hope today. Yes, Big difference in the, night, in the last three days, amen? That was an awesome thought the pastor had this morning that he spoke to us about. Had a good time yesterday. How many was at the picnic yesterday? How many soared today to play softball yesterday? <laughs> Oh, you guys are too young to be, be sore. <laughs> we had a good time yesterday. A lot of good fellowship, a lot of good food, and just uh, man, we had a great turnout. It was just a good time. That's what I love about being a Christian, just fellowship with one another. Amen. We had a great time. Amen. And it's good to see some old faces here. I haven't seen them a long time. Good set. Bobby, Bobby with us this morning and his family. And just... Uh, it uh, brings back old memories, brings back memories when I see faces sometimes and things in the past. It's, a, it's an awesome thing. Hallelujah. Bow your heads with me this morning and let's pray. We love you, Lord. We thank you for this day, Father. Not only did you make this day, Father, but this day was made for you. And we thank you, Father, for sending your Son into this world, for what he went through. Every insult, every every blow that he took, every tear on his body, the nails that were driven in his hands and feet. Thank you for the blood that was shed for our sins today, Lord. We rejoice in you today, Father. God, uh, we don't have any sad stories to tell today, Father, to share, Lord. All my troubles and our, our situations in our lives can't compare, Father, to the joy and the, and the hope that we have in you for tomorrow, Lord, today and tomorrow, for eternity. And we thank you, Lord, for just letting us be here today, Father. We give you the glory and the praise, Lord. I pray, Father, that if there's one person here this morning that doesn't know you, Lord, help them to make that decision, Father. The decision is going to affect eternity for them, Lord. I pray and ask it in Jesus' name today. And everybody said. Amen. Amen. Maybe see you for just a moment. I'm going to go through some announcements real quick. 
Tonight at 5 o'clock we have service again. We say, uh, hope, hope that you'll come back and be with us and rejoice in the Lord today. Amen. All right. Wednesday night service. Uh, is youth, youth night Wednesday night, Chad? Reese? No, it's not youth night Wednesday night. No, it's not. Okay. We have a special speaker. All right. Come on down and uh, you'll be blessed. With you'll be announced. The Lord will be preaching. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We'll have a good time. Have a good time. Yeah. All right. Thursday night, this men's prayer at 7 o'clock here in the uh, sanctuary. We meet up here in this comfortable chairs and sit and talk and just fellowship and we pray. Uh, guys, go on down. We'll have a good time of fellowship. Also, Thursday night's turning points. It says, this class is for anyone in the church or the community that needs encouragement uh, to live a, a life pleasing to God. And if you have any questions about that, see Brother Troy or Brother Joseph. They can explain all that to you. All right, Friday night, we're going to be cleaning the church about 5.30. I'm sure Sister Vanessa needs more volunteers. If you'd like to help do that on Friday night, see Sister Vanessa about that. You're going to be blessed. We've got some good things coming up this month. And uh, one of them is today. Amen. Amen. Glad to be here today on Easter Sunday. April 22nd, uh, we're, guys, we're going to be at BB's Cafe. We'll probably be uh, leaving the church here about 6.30. We'll be here at the church and we'll carry it going down there. Uh, we're going to have a good, good time to fellowship. April 27th is Women's Fellowship at 6.30. April 28th, Chris Jackson is going to be here with us. How many of you remember Chris Jackson? You guys, you got to be here. you got to be here. Chris is a great speaker, a uh, great man of God, and a uh, very talented man. And uh, you, You'll be blessed if you come out. Now, that's going to be on a Wednesday night, so come on out and be with us. May 8th is the ladies' luncheon. May 9th, the next day, is Mother's Day. Uh, May 13th to the 15th, the women's retreat in Oxnard, California. And uh, who's in charge of that, of that Sister Lord? I guess I would be. You, you would be, Sister, Sister, Sister Lord. Yeah. Sister Darling Bishop will be speaking. I have literature at home that I forgot, so I'll bring it tonight. So if you're interested in going to this uh, women's mm -hmm. retreat, just let me know. Okay. Uh, May 21st, Tea Challenge Barbecue out at the ranch. How many ever been to that barbecue out there? Oh, man, I'll tell you, if you like to eat, that's the place to go. That's the place to go. The tickets are uh, $15, and let our pastors know that if you're going to go, because we want to reserve tables just for our church. We have to, we have to let them know uh, how many plan comes to make it.